You I'm mad, mad ho. You I'm mad, bitch. bitch. You big I'm mad, in my bitch. You mad, bitch. You mad, bitch. Like me, ho. I am in you my mad, bitch. Like me, ho. Why you mad, me. bitch? Why you, you mad, bitch? Be a hoe nobody wants As your to friend you, say, bitch. you dry you pussy, you ho. Nobody you wants dry to pussy, you, ho. You oh, mad, ho. You, know, you, you mad, mad, bitch. Touch you me. dry pussy, ho. You're mad nobody you wants too wants lame to ass. even You're argue with you, fucking dry pussy, ass. bitch. You too lame to argue with, you. bitch. Scissors don't even want to meet you. She's afraid of you. Stupid. That is true. Scissors don't even want you, bitch. Well, this is... This is the thing. I feel bad for Chris because if you ever look at a direct picture of Chris's face, one of her eyes is going this way, the other way is looking down. She yeah, had this Chris crazy fucking eyes. hair. She had, this, she, had, she had this crazy haircut that just shows she doesn't get her haircut. I feel bad. I kind of felt bad that time where I, 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 no, no, but I'm saying when I, I showed her the text message where Sisters yeah. was like, I would never meet her in real life. She yeah, scares never. me. Yeah, exactly. And she still hasn't that's met her. Like, and it doesn't register in her head. Because she scares everybody. Like, they don't fucking like her. They kiss her ass because she tried to kidnap Chris Jenner. They're afraid she's going to try to do that shit, too. The fuck? You can, ask her, you can ask her a question. But no, all jokes aside, Chris is a fucking loser to be talking to somebody who, who doesn't want to meet you up in real life. Bro, they're 28 minutes away. I'm going to keep saying this because I think it's the funniest thing. Sister showed me the map thing on her phone. They're 28 minutes away from each other. And she and Chris has tried to meet her and she has given every excuse in the book. Bruh, you are a fucking loser, Chris. And, I, and I'll tell you that if you were younger than me, you, I, I, I probably would feel bad. But you're 10 years fucking older than me. You're a fucking weirdo to be continuously talking to somebody who you know, if you were to show up at their doorstep, she would call the cops. Like I told her that on the live one time. I was like, bro, I will pay for your Uber X. From your doorstep to her doorstep, a billion dollars that I don't have. If Scissor sees you on the front doorstep, she's going to call the police. The minute you ring that doorbell and she looks and she sees your fucking crazy face, police called. All that I love you is going to be out the window. And she knows that because she didn't take me up on the offer. I, I, that's on YouTube if anybody wants to see it. I stood there for like 30 minutes. I like, bro, I will pay for you to go straight to her doorstep. Guarantee she's going to call the cops on you. She does not like you like that. She is scared of you. But hey, I'm... I'm just a truth teller. I'm sorry. I, I stand on truth. That's why I show my shit. You see this video? I was going to ask Chris before she dropped. I wanted to know what she think about it. This is a video from yesterday on TikTok when this crazy bitch was in my live. What's up? Hey, Chris. What's up? Chris, real quick. This video is from TikTok Live yesterday. Scissors is in my box. What do you think about that? She said she talks to you. I mean, what, what, what's wrong? What's the problem? What? Bro, stop. She said she talks to you. You just... <laughs> what the fuck ever, man? Whatever. Well, you say two different things. You, t I've seen of, I've seen snaps of you on Snapchat where you're telling, you're telling Sizzy that you're proud of her. No, no, no. People send me clips. People send me clips. Here. Now, I'm not talking about you. I said people send me clips of you when you tell Sizzy you're proud of her for not talking to me. Here's the proof that she still jumps into my lives on TikTok. She's right there, right fucking now. She this is yesterday. She admitted today, about an hour ago or two, she said she still talks to you. What I'm supposed to do, so what do you her with a belt? But what do you think about when she calls me monster? And you really think she thinks I'm a monster if she's constantly watching me all the time? Or do you think she's a fucking stalker? She, she, you, she says she's trauma bonded to you. I don't know what you I don't know her! her. How would I be trauma bonded to somebody that I, that I don't know like that? How what you don't fuck? know her when you said, wait, 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 Scholar, how you don't know her when you said you flew, and she flew out there for I didn't eight apply. hours. Yeah, eight hours. Yeah, so that how was you like don't six know months her? ago. Because I don't. That, oh, eight hours don't count for shit. A little bit. Yeah, for that, and for that eight hours, that's it. That's like six months ago. But you know what you're doing, too? You're using Laura to get under her skin. Any other I'm not using anything. No, her. I'm not. I was talking to Laura where, where, when I first seen when I first uh, spoke to her. Out. I thought she was cool. Y'all had fell out. Y'all had. We fell didn't out. fall out. No, we didn't. And Scala and not Scala. My bad. Um, Scissor said, "Don't talk to her," and you abided by that. Well, Scissor told me not to talk to Laura. Mm-hmm. And you is, stopped is talking to her. Matter of fact, you started. You you went bad on her. You started cussing her out and doing your little. 
you know. No, no. What happened was when when sisters modded me on her page, she told me to book, kick Laura out every time she came in, and I was like, I don't have an issue with her. I'm not doing that shit. And then I kicked her one time because she kept fucking asking me, and then sisters blocked her, and that's when that's when Laura came back around and she figured out that sisters was full of shit because sisters. I mean, Laura really thought that Scissors had a problem. She didn't really know the whole picture. She, she didn't see this crazy bitch for what everybody else is seeing. So when she saw that she got blocked, she was like, you know what? That's when I knew that it, it wasn't you that was doing it. She wanted me blocked. And I told her, listen, this is the phone call. We, only, we had one phone call about Laura. And it was Scissors. You're flirting with her because she's beautiful. You're flirting with her. I don't want her around me. I was like, what the fuck? You fucking weirdo. Bro. I don't even know you. I don't even know the Scissors like that. What the fuck? Even if it's eight hours that. Well, that's six months ago. I barely remember that shit. I don't know anybody else from six months ago. I can't even spin a fucking date on a colander and remember somebody from six months ago that I met like in the supermarket or some shit. What the Laura, fuck? Ain't catching, that Laura ain't catching no strays um, because this is what she do. I'm not talking to you, scholar. I'm talking to the comments. Hold on. Because what the fuck she does is she acts like she innocent. She not hostile. She don't want to get in... Um, do her little ones and twos with people, but when she got caught saying that shit behind Mommy Chronicles back, and Mommy was ready to tussle with her, she talking about, oh, I don't, I don't, I don't do that. I don't do that. Like she's too, she too good to. Uh, but you got caught. You got caught though. You sure was running for Mommy ass though. All of a okay, sudden. Okay. Though, but can you ahead. admit that the only problem Scissors has with Laura is that Laura talks to me? That's the only problem Scissors has with her. Can you admit that? Okay, the only problem that Scissors has is that you... Well, you try to make is her... Is that Laura to talks make, to me? You try to make her jealous. I think you playing both of the girls again. Bruh, no, I her. don't. I don't know her. I'm not dating her. I'm not nothing. How can I make her jealous if we're not nothing? That means I can't talk to any girl at all? Well, it's, it, it seems like she likes you a lot. Scissors still has a little thing for what you. What the fuck Laura does that have to do about, with me? Laura what does that have to do about, with me? No, I don't. No, I don't. I don't know what I'm I'm not doing shit. I'm not leading nobody on. I'm not anything. But there's a screenshot that somebody showed me, which fucking scissors called me her ex-boyfriend. She's fucking delusional. She was in Post Bill's it. Live, I think. Post, Post it. it. All right, give me a second. Wait, uh let, let me hold it. Let me just get the fucking shit sent to my phone. If you're still in here, I'm not gonna say who it is. Can you text me that picture to my phone, please? Because you, you're the one that sent me that screenshot, and I could just show it off my phone. I know, Dennis. Hold on. Is there a way I can enter my inbox? Through, wait, hold on. I think I can enter my inbox. Hold up. Oh motherfucker! Wait, yeah, 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 I'm almost there. Hold on, nah, I, I could, I, I could actually enter my inbox if you didn't know that. Hold up. Wait a second. Oh. Oh my God! A second. All right. Well, we'll send it anyway. Uh, but I'll probably get to it before you send it to me. Okay. Yeah, because it, it's. Uh, I'm trying to find it in the inbox, but. Hold up. I need to screenshot it. Because if I... Oh, there. Wait, wait. No, I'm there. Hold up. I'm almost there. Can I save it to my phone from the inbox? Oh, there you go. No, I can only delete it. Hold up. God damn it. I can't even open it up all the... I'm going to fucking take a picture of it. Hold up. <sighs> So this is hopefully the person sends it to my fucking phone, but I'm I'm gonna take a picture of the screenshot that I have in my inbox. One second, so you you could see this fucking crazy shit. Where the fuck is my camera on this? There you go. This is gonna be so fucking blurry. Hold up. Damn, I don't want to show who sent it to me. <laughs> fuck. Send me that damn. Wait, hey, hey. Wait, wait. Right there. Okay. Now I could crop this one second. Now let me just crop out because I don't want y'all to know who sent this to me. Hold up. Uh, this is taking so long. All right, crop and all right. Now we're there. Save as copy. All right. Now see this. Hold up. Hold up. Uh, 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 uh. Let me make this. Make plug this bitch out. I'll go back to that later. 
Now, read. Wait, now let me mirror this shit so you could read it the fucking right way. There you go. Now, that took so fucking long. I hate fucking Beagle. This is not fun. All right. Now, what does this say? Can, oh, can someone screenshot that and then so I could blow it up? Because I don't have my glasses. I can't really see it. Or just read it. Damn. I'm trying to get it to where you could fucking... I don't know why there's a fucking glare. I've just turned on the light. Damn, I could barely put that in the comments. Can you screenshot it and put... Yeah, it's blurry. Hold up. Oh, when you zoom in? All right, so, I, so if I don't zoom in... Is that no? But then you can't barely fucking see it. I fucking hate this shit. How can why can I read it, and then the fucking opposite way, as as them post it? Hold up, fucking bitch. Let me uh send this to myself, and I'll fucking. But then I can't. How do I? It's it's an ex an ex boyfriend. Yeah, there you go. That person read it. They they read what it said. How the fuck did that person? All right, so let me read it be, before I get sent the wait the actual fucking picture. So scissors is in Bill's live saying unless you want to have an ex boyfriend of yours stream your private phone calls on his live. So she's there. You go. The person just did it. Now everybody fucking can you read that? Damn, it's blurry though. Fuck. What the fuck kind of fucking app is this? Randall's live. Whoever the fuck's live. I don't know who the fuck live it was. I, I wasn't fucking there, goddamn it. I get sent the shit. <laughs> so, so once again, I'm a fucking... There's no way to do that. Like, yo, this is the... I don't know why it's so blurry from my end. Read it. All right, I'll read it. So Scissors is in Randall's live, and she says... And I'll post it on Snapchat, goddamn it, because I don't know why the fucking shit is so blurry. Or whoever... I'm. Hopefully the person posted it in the comment section. She says, unless you want to have an ex-boyfriend of yours, stream your private phone call on his live. So I have streamed her private phone call. So she, in, in essence, she's calling me an ex-boyfriend. I never dated her. What the fuck do you make of that? This is an insane person who has a fucking different w v version of reality than everybody else. I never dated her at all. Why is she calling me an ex-boyfriend? That doesn't make any fucking sense. Okay, go on. So, what did Okay, no, I, I'm just saying, like that, that like I, I'm saying that you're her ex boyfriend. I'm not. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. This is my whole point. Prove that you're not. Okay, it's very really easy. I never was. I never dated her at all. The fuck? I don't even know her like that. Once again, and I'll I'll figure out a way to fucking. Oh, hold up. Whenever I get something, hopefully the fucking person can post it in the chat. But here's my point. This is my point. So this person has a different version of reality than what actually happened. I didn't fucking date her. Never have. And why is she calling me a fucking ex-boyfriend? That proves that she's a fucking psycho, bro. What do, how can you say you don't know her like that? But you, It doesn't matter if I did. I didn't date her. I'm not with her. I never was. You have to admit you keep I don't keep her around. She's not in my box right now. What the fuck? How do I am I keeping what around? <laughs> she fucking unblocks me and tells me to come into her live. And most of the time, 99% of the time, I fucking don't. The only thing that got me in there today is because I just happened to peek in and she was talking shit about me once again because somebody on Snapchat told me it was happening. So I was like, you didn't block her, so she's not really a stalker. I don't have to block her, though. Why do I have to block her? I don't have to block anybody. Well, she she's not crazy to the point where I'm fucking like scared or anything, but she's crazy to the point where she she has seen reality in a different fucking way. I never dated her. Chris, has she ever told you that I dated her? No, but no, but now, Scarlett, you know damn well when you was up in her box when y'all was getting along, she was she was you was doing any everything she told you to do. You were so happy to be back with her, though, in her presence. No, I wasn't. Mm. Then why? Okay, no, no. then why was why was you there? What happened? What happened was is that we talked, and I was like, bro, it's better that we don't talk online if we're gonna ever fucking text and be cool, or whatever. Because I text a bunch of people. I don't have no problem with that. She wants me on Beagle for some reason. She wants me to fucking come in. She wants me 
Like, like I said, the only reason I'm talking about her now once again is because she was just talking about me once again. She just fucking crashed out over me or some shit. She said, I, I don't have a video that I do have. Now, what does that make me do? Like, she's saying, like, I'm a liar or some shit. I'm just going to show the fucking video that she says I don't have. And then when I show the video, then she crashes out. Like, she, she's looking for a reason to crash out. And I'll be the one to give her to her because I don't give a fuck. You're not going to be saying that. I don't need to lie about anything, especially about fucking her. When she's saying, oh, he has no video. Bro, I just showed the video. That's why my live just got taken down for 10 minutes. I don't give a fuck. Like, you talk, you always talk about her every single day. I talk about, I probably talk about her a lot when I come on here because I only come on here because she's talking about me on another fucking live, motherfucker. The fuck? I'm not on... That TikTok live that I just posted, which I'm going to play to the end, that live had nothing to do with her. She just happened to be in there because she's always in my fucking live. The discussion had nothing to do with her. What so fucking ever? Absolutely nothing. She fucking just brought herself up and started arguing with somebody in my box. And the only reason I play that is to prove that she fucking follows me around. So this shit where trauma bonding or all this shit is coming, I don't know what the fuck she's talking about. Now let me get to the part. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I know. I so anyway, so let me get. So this is what, what this is the shit that that fucking irks me. And as a guy, this I, I said this before and shit. This is the shit that fucking irks me. That this bitch gets to sit here and make up these fucking lies. Like, I'm, I don't know what the fuck she, she can't, she never shows any proof. Like, saying that I fucking swatted her to talk to her, never did that shit. That's fucking weird, especially her. Sirs is a fucking old, ugly woman, bro. I, I'm gonna be fucking quite honest with you. And I say that proudly right now because she has gotten fucking weirder looking and weirder looking. The more weight she gained, the fucking worse she looks. She got these big ass elf ears, this big ass fucking nose. No, nothing matches on her face. Bro, she's like fucking like, she, she, she's in her fucking mid 40s already. What the fuck? And she let herself go fucking coming to Beagle sitting here for fucking 20 hours a day and shit. Bitch getting like fucking 100 pounds and shit. Fuck that bitch. You, you'll be like, bro, you know, like something like you, what the fuck is wrong with you? But you still, yeah, but this is six months ago. Six months ago. You know how much could change in six months? She don't even look like the same person. She don't even look like the fucking same person six months ago. She looks like a completely different. That's why she puts that fucking cartoon fucking shit on her face to make her look like a fucking Disney character and shit. Yeah, six months changes, motherfucker. A lot. A lot. Fucking fat ass bitch. She only 40. I did a background check on her. No, she's not. She's 42. That's a goddamn lie. Bro, I, well, I'm going to believe you, a random person in the comment section? You fucking idiot. Bro, that's, you're, you probably are her, you fucking weirdo. <laughs> did you hear that? Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Let's play it again. Oh. Like, you, you don't get So, once again, proving a point right here, this bitch is a psychopath talking shit about me, still joining my goddamn lives. This live is from yesterday night. Because, truth be told, I like TikTok more than I like Beagle. Because TikTok brings in new people and shit. Beagle's the same fucking people and over and over again. I'll come here to roast somebody, goddamn it. Like, I'm roasting this bitch right now because I don't give a fuck. You ain't going to call me monster, bro. How you going to call me a monster looking the way you look? You fucking old wicked witch of the fucking east looking bitch. This bitch got a big ass fucking Halloween nose. Big ass. Have you seen her fucking ears, bro? The fuck out of here. Big ass floppy ears and shit. Talking about that I'm a monster bitch. I would never. But if there was ever somebody to stalk, it would not be you. You fucking weird looking fat bitch. Like you're disgusting in every fucking form of the way, bro. She has never stood up on camera. There's no videos of her standing up. She got this big ass kangaroo pouch that she fucking tucks in with like eight straps every fucking morning. She takes that shit off. She just rolls out of her shit. Tell her to jiggle her arm on fucking camera. And then we'll see who's stalking who. You big nasty bitch. Let's continue on with the video though. Like you, you don't get respect from anybody in here if you can't respect yourself. Period. Yes, and you are fucked up. Yo, and mind you, here real quick, on Beagle, the only reason she keeps saying she sent me uh, news is because she said it herself on a Beagle Live to people who were listening. And she and somehow it's my fault that she sent it to me. I never showed your stuff. Bro, I don't even have your stuff on my phone. You just send it to me. I can't take Yo! <laughs> you cannot make this shit up, yo. Notice when I'm talking about this shit, she sits in the box and has no fucking. She has nothing to say because nothing that I'm saying is a fucking lie. Bro, you're a. Listen, listen, listen to me. You're sick. Ex boyfriend? How the fuck? 
I can't wait till I get that picture sent to me because I'm gonna post it on Snapchat because that's the only this. I don't know why I can't fucking show this shit here, but what kind of sick bastard thinks I'm an ex boyfriend of somebody that you talk to on TikTok like everybody else? Like at that point, anybody else who's in this fucking TikTok live is is my girlfriend, I guess. Fucking nasty. 